Yeah, it's Kira. The new boss is already at the site. We're gonna head over that way now. Okay, people, this is day one of Horizon Australia. We need to get these cars over to the festival site of Byron Bay. Listen up, Australia. This is Scott, coming to you live from Horizon Radio. We've traveled halfway across the world, and I can't believe we're finally here. I'm looking out the window, and I have to tell you, they have beaches here to take your breath. They may call this the land down under, baby, but all I'm saying is I've never seen anything less down or under. And it's hot, and the roads are just wide open, bro. We're talking fast cars, cool beats, summer sun. Classic style. Blazing days, banging nights, burnt rubber, wild parties, and exotic animals. So put your pedal to the floor as we welcome you to Horizon Australia for the biggest, the best, the most out of control event in the history of the Horizon Festival. What is going on guys? It is your boy Tyre here. And I am bringing to you some Horizon or Forza Horizon 3. Absolutely love this game. Um, it's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful racing, and um, been into it a lot lately. However, my last save file got corrupted, so I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and make a new series on it. Um, I absolutely love this game, so it's like, why not? Uh, it's beautiful scenery and just, I don't know they killed this game it's it's unbelievable <laughs> um, I wasn't really into the um, other like the, the Forza Motorsport series as much um, just because I didn't really like the track racing but I don't know that's just me maybe I'll get into number seven when it comes out on the Xbox One X which I will definitely be getting um, but who knows? Um, so yeah, I hope you guys really enjoy this series when it drops. <laughs> um, hopefully, uh, I've got a bunch of different stuff I'm going to be working on, so we'll see, you know, how this lines up. Hey, look out, out of my way! I've got 800 horses here, I'm not afraid to use them! I absolutely love that it's off-roading as well. I left that thing with you for a brake and overhaul. many different types of vehicles. Okay, Kira, would you say <laughs> something about brakes? Well, I mean, look at that. We're Come on now. We're taking the Great Ocean Road to Byron. What just other racing game have you seen? Don't do anything stupid. That is graphics just like that, besides maybe Need for Speed. And I don't even think they're like that. But Most Wanted, uh, the, the newest Most Wanted scenery, it was awesome. But gameplay wasn't the best, in my opinion. But uh, this definitely is probably one of the best racing games out ever. Uh, I don't know what you guys think, but that's my opinion. I'm sticking to it. You know what to say, opinions are like assholes and everybody has one. So if you don't agree, it's okay. I'll forgive you. Wow. Taking first place. Oops. <laughs> yeah, this game is unbelievable. Let's see. I couldn't help but to think like all those supercars and they're all on dirt. It can't be good. The local 
the right. press are asking so for let's go ahead and see which character I'm gonna be. I think I was this character last time. I'll go with this gentleman right now. Okay, and what should I call you? Okay, great. So I'll call you Anthony. Anthony. Hey, Anthony. What do you think of the Driving place? Driving that AMG. It may not look it yet, but over the summer, you're going to turn this into the biggest Horizon Festival the world has ever seen. We have an amazing team keeping the festival running, but everything else is on you. You'll be choosing the type of racing we do, the music we play, and the star drivers we sign. This is your festival. Listen, I know you've just arrived, but the very first event starts in a few minutes, and I've got you the best seat in the house. I absolutely love this race coming up. Pretty sure I have to race a helicopter. Yep. You'll be driving the buggy for the launch event against that Jeep. Thought I'd start you off with an easy one. Let you loosen up. <laughs> what? I said easy, not boring. I don't know if it's actually possible to lose these. Um, these type of races. But that's just because I get to lose one. Oh. Oh no. I don't know why I was thinking it turned off, but. Whoops. That's called me just not paying attention. The Jeep only, I think it did hit the house. Poor guy that's sitting in that Jeep right now. Five percent of the way, or twenty-five percent left. I know you guys see how it says press Y to rewind. I'm trying to avoid that in this series as much as possible. Oh shit! as hell. <laughs> what a way to start the party! 
keep pulling in fans at this rate and we'll have to start thinking about expanding the festival. Yeah, it's not a whole lot of fans. I think my last uh, time I played the series I was at like a few million fans in the Forzaverse. Nice driving, boss. Name's Warren. Resident car tragic. I know you're in charge, but I'm your bloke in the garage. So you need anything car related, you come to me. Oh, one more thing before we go, though. Kira said you might want to drive the Centenario. Yeah, why not? I like Lambros. Lambo. We're starting to bring some pretty big name guest drivers into the festival now. Most of them just want a chance to line up next to you. I say we give it to them. There's a driver I've had my eye on around here. Find them, beat them in a race, and we can sign their driver to up to the festival lineup. Okay. Go ahead and set the route. Hey, Anthony. Your route is set to the area where you'll be able to find the driver tar. I really love the driver tar system. And, uh... In 400 yards... Forza games. I really, I think it's cool how they uh, have the AI as actually your friends, where it actually studies how you drive and how you race. That way, um, you can race your friends, you know, uh, without them actually having to be on. So that's pretty, pretty neat. This is your boy Scott Tyler, and I am here to tell you that Horizon has landed in Australia. Speaking of landings. Did anyone else just see that? Oh, you know, just an army helicopter racing a buggy through the forest with a jeep swinging underneath it. No big deal here at Horizon. You know what? I got a good feeling about Australia already. And hey, the radio is absolutely feelings. amazing in this game as well. Just commentary that they have in the background. You don't really notice it if you're not paying attention, but it's awesome. They do a great job with it. In 400 yards, turn left. There they are. Challenge them to a head to head. A La Ferrari. I don't know if you guys have ever known, but I'm a massive car guy. I absolutely love cars. And, uh, this game is like perfect for me. Oh man, that little lag though. Lineup. All right. The more successful drivers you get to join your lineup, the more fans will attract to the festival. I'll let you know next time we've identified a potential lineup recruit. Cool. All right. In 400 yards. Let's head back. This hurts me, just driving a Lambo on the beach. That hurts. Like, I know it's just a game, but come on now. <laughs> we. Alrighty then. Do we take okay, boss. the Beamer? To really start the Silva? In the fans and the GT350R? We need to get you huh. racing. For that, you'll need or your car. some Australian. Or whatever, I don't know what it is. Piece of crap. Um, 
I went with the M4 coupe last time. I don't want the Shelby. I think I'm going to go with the Sylvia. You see a lot of JDM cars out here. Not a lot like this one, obviously. Sylvia's are nasty. How about a vanity plate? Sum up your personality in eight characters or less? Nah, that's fine. I'll, I'll leave the license plate the same. Um, 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 um. <laughs> if I want, I'm pretty sure I can always go back and change the license plate. This Horizon Festival is going to be big. Bigger than ever before. We're going to need to expand our festival site. But to do that, we need fans. And to bring in fans, we need you out there, running races and performing PR stunts. Our festival scouts have been hard at work mapping points of interest with these markers. Set a route to a marker, and let's see what we can find. All right. We'll go ahead and do this. It's not too far. I'm working on signing a whole range of music labels and artists. But it's your call, boss. Who will it be? Vagrant, Vagrant Records Radio. Indie and alternative rock. Cool. I'll get the deal signed. I wish Epitaph was open, because I would sign them too. We'll do Block Party too. I'll sign up Horizon Block Party right away. Conspicuously nice spot for a race route. Just drive up Not to the marker to start. Home. All right, people want to see you racing, so let's start things off with a single race exhibition. All right, we'll start it off. Some three seventy Z's. Back on the road. Man, that's one hell of a multiplier we just got. Almost 60,000. In the first race, it's hella decent. That car was definitely catching up to me. <laughs> Chalk it up, boss. That's a win. Plenty more to come, I hope. Yeah, 
balance. 32,000. Hey, not a whole lot, but it's something. Boss, we're very nearly at fan capacity. Just a few more and I can roll out the next stage of festival plans. Get you some new toys to play with. Hey. I like toys. Especially the Koenigsegg that will be coming eventually. Hey Anthony, I'm your automated natural navigation assistant. You can call me Anna. I've been given an upgrade by the Horizon Tech team back in Cambridge. I'm going to suggest things for you to do and help you find your way around Australia. Okay. For now, would you like me to set you a route to the next activity? Sure, why not? Great. If you need me again, just press down on the D-pad. Will do. Turn left. All right, Horizon. Byron Bay is now live. The tents are up, the stages are up, and the people are pouring in. It looks like a cross between the best music festival I've ever been to and all the freeways it took to get here. This is Van Pierzolowski settling into the Vagrant Records booth. It's going to be a good one, so stick around. This is a danger sign. These are hazardous locations our scouts have identified and cordoned off for your safety. Or so you can easily find the best and craziest stunt jumps in the country. <laughs> Whichever you prefer. I like the stunt jump part. You have arrived at your destination. Still alive, Buff? Excellent. They love that one. I'll tell the scouts to find more. Meanwhile, I'm about to go and have a very lively phone call with our insurance company. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, there went my spoiler. <laughs> hey, Anthony. This is a circuit race. Four asphalt route, specified number of laps. Sounds simple enough? Sure. Let's see how many laps. I think it's three. Hmm. Exhibitions are big with the fans. So are skill chains. Remember, they don't just want you to win. They want you to do it in style, too. They don't just want me to win. I love the accent. Really do. Hmm. What happens when somebody is inviting you to a game? You don't pay attention and you crash. Whoops. Go ahead and get caught back up. really messes with it, man.
Yeah, I'm going to be a good distance away from everybody, it seems, as long as I drive smart. What a finish. It's a good five seconds ahead of the next person. I'll take it. I will take it. Good 9,000 credits. Oh, so close to level two. Hey, Anthony. I've just been down at the Byron Bay site. You can barely move. People are everywhere. I think the time has come. Meet me there when you're ready to start the expansion. All right, let's go ahead and get there so we can start that expansion. Get down here, boss. We're bursting at the seams. In 400 yards. Turn right. Turn right. In 200 yards, turn left. All right. Or I'll just go straight. Turn left. In 400 yards. Turn right. In 100 yards, turn right. Just because this is fun. Yards, and it gets me right. some skill multipliers and stuff like that. Hey, this is Van on Vagrant Radio. So, yesterday our bass player Greg was driving the tour bus and took a little detour through a Horizon billboard. I thought we were going to get into some serious trouble, but turns out not so much. Every time you level up, you get a wheel spin. Hey, let's go ahead and spin. Wheel spins offer big credit and car prizes. You can even win limited Horizon Edition cars. 50,000. Alright, I'll take it. In 400 yards, then right. let's go and hit this uh, expansion. Keep right. You have arrived at your destination. Ooh, that was close. All right. First Byron Bay, then Australia, then... Actually, I think we might just stay in Australia. It's awfully nice here. <laughs> Except for the spiders. Australia has some big-ass spiders. I don't do that. Welcome to the auto show. All right. Love your work so far, boss. Kira said I should get you set up with another car for this next set of races. Yep, I'm gonna need Take one. Take a look at these, and whichever you fancy is yours to keep. I'm gonna go with the Lambo. The Lamborghini Urus. Things a beast. I know we like to say Horizon is all about the music and cars, but you know what? The painters deserve a shout too. Some of the stuff these guys produce should be in a gallery. You can check out what paint Let's jobs see. people have done here and choose one for your car. That one's pretty cool. Tell you what, though. I think we're going to have to go with Monster Energy. Because, you know, who doesn't like Monster? Come on now. I mean, to be honest, I prefer Nos. But, hey, you know, I can't hate. Love you too, monster. All right. All right. So this is Ooh. your new car. You can just so stay here nice. and admire her beauty if you like, or if you want to add any visual upgrades, just let me know. When you're done, just drive her out into the festival. 
this part I really really like as well that you can actually go and like zoom in zoom out I can sit in there if I want close the door if I want and just check it everything yeah that's cool all right go ahead and drive this beast of a van beast of an SUV I can't say van that's it's kind of mean I know the paint's not dry on our Byron expansion yet, but we could really bring Horizon to more fans if we open a second festival location. Meanwhile, I've just got the latest reports from our scout crews, all marked on your map. No rest for the wicked. Ain't no rest for the wicked. Let's go ahead and see. Undiscovered route. You know, to be honest, when it is safe to do so. Let's see. I think we're gonna go ahead and uh, cut it here, and next time you will see us head down to the southwest and the little town that's over there and get some races done over there. Um, but we're coming up on about 35-ish minutes here. So I'm going to go ahead and cut it now. And I will see you guys next time. Have a good one.